Hey guys, it's Palmer. Welcome to Forge Reviews Best of the Past, where I highlight the uh, best Forge Reviews I reviewed in a certain amount of episodes. This episode will cover episodes 1 to 20, and um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, break down the top 5 maps here and order them from uh, number 5 down to 1. So eventually we'll cover uh, all the Forge Reviews and then we'll find out the number 1 ever reviewed. So coming in at number 5 here, we have Drive Challenge, and um, what this map is, it's not exactly a race map because there's no checkpoints, but um. You'll see here, it's more of a challenge race map where you have to try to uh, stay on the track and uh, not fall off. At this point here, I, fall, I uh, fall off. I like how he has it though because he kind of has it set up so uh, it's, it's meant for you to fall off. If you fall off, no big deal. You get sent through a teleporter, you're back on the track. So, it's a little tough, but it's also a pretty cool map. And, um, you know, it's a good way to test out your skills. I myself am not a very good driver, so. Um, it's just not, it's, that's why I fell off a lot, but anyway, <laughs> um, so yeah, it's a pretty good map, I think that's why I came in number 5, and just so you guys know, these maps aren't picked just by me, there was a, uh, secret panel of judges that, um, picked these, and also my votes were included, but it, w it wasn't just me, so, that's it for a uh, uh, driving challenge. Coming in at number 4 is Barren Wasteland, it's a uh, race map, and it's a very, very good race map. In my opinion, I mean, there's a lot of race maps out there, and um, you know, in order to get to the top of those, it has to be well put together. And this map is well put together. I mean, as you can see here, visually, it, there's no bumps, and while you're riding, you can't feel any. So, I mean, this map is very, very smooth, and overall, I just think it's a very nice race map. Now, this map takes you uh, on the track and off the track. It takes you, um, you know, off-roading on the track. It just in some of those parts, though, uh, when you're going off-road, it does get a little confusing because there's no definite track. But other than that, this map is really good, and um, I think it's a pretty cool map. So that's it for uh, Barren Wasteland. And at number three, we have one of my all-time favorite maps, Dang the China. And um, this is a pretty cool map. And um, so you, what you do here is um, there's a uh, it's infection game mode. So um, at at your right here, there's a zombie. Um, he's really slow. He can't move very fast. And um, he's stuck in a cage for a certain amount of time. Your objective is to try to uh, get away from him before he can uh, go through that cage and uh, come and kill you. Your objective is to hurry up and try to get through all of these different um, pathways and hurry up and get to where you gotta go to uh, defend yourself. So you saw back there, we had to destroy those crates and then push forward. We had to go through all those shield doors. Next little cave filled with balls. And lastly, we're in this room here. So you get the jetpacks, and up there you'll see a, uh, tel a teleporter you can take, or you can um, go through with a jetpack. So either way, you can get there, and lastly is the final room where you want to stay and defend. I was, at this point in time, I was the last one alive, and I was trying to defend, but I uh, get killed. So that's it for the China. It's a pretty cool map. At number two, we have Jelly, probably one of my more uh, favorite uh, race maps of all time. It's a race map, like I just said there, and um, it's more, it's kind of like a little challenge. It's not uh, too, too hard, but it is also kind of hard. So, uh, what I'm saying there is, there is parts of it that are easy, and um, there is parts that can be a little bit of a challenge. I uh, end up falling off at some point in time. But this map's a really good map, you know, if you have a couple of friends to play with, or if you're just by yourself trying to, you know, beat the... Uh, beat it and um i just think it's a pretty cool map overall and um you know there's no doubt why it shouldn't have gotten second place here and um i think it's just a really good map and i um i would suggest this map actually and that's it for uh jelly lastly at number one we have one of my all-time favorite maps ever made on halo reach the map known as trench wars the game type for this map is trench warfare and um what it is it's a territory game mode but um you'll see here that this map is like a um it kind of mimics a uh, real battlefield and you know what the trench is and certain amount of intervals spaced out and um you know i think it's a really cool map you know having like battling against your friends with your friends or just random people you know having to fight forward or retreating trying to gain those positions and you know you can just have a lot of fun there there's no doubt why I came in first place. It was really just a great map. And uh, that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a comment if you would. I put a lot of work in this video, so, you know, comments and feedback is great. And I will see you guys on the next episode here in the future sometime. And I will see you guys later. Bye.